All right, lads. Now this is the Demeter slaying squad. Look at this. This this squad is perfect for just taking down Demeter. Easy. We could do the stall setup, but what if we just brought Kentucky Rider and just beat up Demeter? Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Not even to be all that hard. Just keep punching. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can't even read what that says, dude. The anti-Demeter meme team. It's probably good enough. See, I don't remember exactly what I did on NA, but I remember it was just Kentucky Rider pretty much soloed Demeter, and I think Ketz came in at the very end and just threw her into the sun. I don't really remember it being that bad. Yeah, I don't know what, like, look, all the, like, gods in their normal forms look really good. Like, Demeter, I think, looks pretty banging. Aphrodite looks pretty banging. Zeus looks like such an ultra chatty character. I want Zeus, dude. I would summon for that ruler, Zeus. But then they all turn into just the most goofy ah looking people you've ever seen in your entire life. They just look bizarre. I know Demeter is going to yeet all of our buffs. I don't want to overcommit. I don't want to commit too hard on this. But I think this should kill. I think. I don't think I need to use the Buster card. I think this should be fine. Should be fine. Should be A-OK. -okay. Kentoki does do the damage. Hopefully. And if it's not, it's fine. Because our buffs are going to get yeeted anyway. So like it doesn't matter if we use one turn or two turns to clear this part. Bro is really going to be like two damage off. It doesn't really matter because we're going to lose our buffs anyway. And we've got a lot of damage cuts. So we're not going to take very much damage anyway. So like we're fine. But it is slightly annoying. Okay, we at least have a way to guarantee cast Tori getting to her MP. Alright, surely the Buster Crit just clears. Surely Buster Crit <laughs> solos this. Yeah, there we go. Okay, barely by, by like 6,000 damage, but we got it. Okay, now we don't even have to use the NP gain skill on cast Tori herself. Oh, this actually ain't bad. Well, nah, that's kind of bad. We don't want to waste this turn on some buffs because we have the buff removal. Um, okay, so we go like this. This cleanses us. This also gives us the uh, the hits of solemn defense. Well, actually, it doesn't really matter because Kentucky's not even going to get the attack buff. So we'll put Castoria a second so we get two hits of solemn defense. And we'll take this, hopefully, and get a big old crit. So we'll do this first because Kentucky Rider's NP doesn't do anything except damage. So I'll have him just kind of smack Demeter over here. And then we'll follow up with the Castoria. That'll give us two hits of Solemn. But we get the Solemn defense because the debuff cleanse applies first. Yeah, not a whole lot of damage from Kentucky, but he has no buffs. What do you want from him? <laughs> and all his CE has is... His CE is just a Pierce defense CE, just because I don't want to deal with her defensive buffs. And so we are able to take one hit from the NP, and then we can also take one regular AoE hit. And then we, re if she attacks three times, we can take that last hit. Although Castoria is looking a little low, little bit low, but it should be fine. We should be all good. Unless she crits, but then Castoria, my goat, lives on a schmeckle of HP. Thank you, Castoria, and let's fire that NP again. Why don't we? Here, buddy, use your heal. I'm always making fun of your heal, but you know what? It's actually coming in clutch. I actually do think I'm going to fire the waiver NP. It might be a bit of a waste, but hopefully if we get the stun, we also get to preserve two hits of solemn defense as well. We're potentially getting two turns here, but waiver's a bum! <laughs> Waver, what are you doing, man? Waver, come on, bro. Waver, what are you doing, bro? What are you doing, man? I need you to stun. I need you to stun. You gotta stun for me, man. Okay, maybe she only does two attacks. Okay, she only does two attacks. Nice. Bro, she wasn't even debuffing me in that turn. That's the funny part. Waver just whiffed. 
Great cast story. Keep yourself alive. Your buffs are kind of nice. Well, then again, you're not really going to be getting your buffs anytime soon. Eh, it's fine. It's fine. Look, maybe my waiver just doesn't like me very much because he's been overworked. Look at that crazy NP refund from Kentucky Rider, by the way. Look at how good this lad is. No, not wait. Oh, waiver. <laughs> I guess he's alive. I guess he's not dying. Okay. Okay, cool. Sure, why not? You know what? DPS waiver. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's keep him alive. Uh. Bro, surely this kills. Surely, surely that kills. It's only 150, and you bypass the damage cut as well. Surely you're fine. Surely you can beat this Demeter up. Still no stun, bro. Oh, I guess you do have the debuff immunity. Or did she not? Or is that one instance of debuff immunity? Well, regardless, it's fine. All we need is that Castori is getting to overcharge three. That's fine. That literally bypasses us a turn. Nice. Easy peasy. I was about to say, Kentucky, if you didn't kill that break bar, I'm disowning you. I'm not going to burn you. You're too good. <laughs> I, I can't I can't let you retire, but I'll disown loser. you. You're a loser. I won't be happy about it. Sorry for yourself? Well, you should be because you are dirt. And now we're chilling. Not the guts! Chilling. Eating up the hits. Literally can't die. Hey, don't skill seal yourself. I need you to use your skills. I need you to waste turns, man. Alright, let's just let Kentoki get in there. Um... So I'm like, we could do a stun. Because since she's skill sealed, yeah, I'll, I'll buy us a turn. Why not? Why not? It's fine. Why not buy ourselves a turn? Why not? Keep our solemn defense, much less for our other characters over here and more so for our goat Kentucky rider. These guys are on their way out there. They need to escuche. They need to... Uh, move. We need to get out of here. Oh, this Kentucky Rider just putting in the work. You wouldn't think he'd be able to do it. He's just like, he's got like two skills realistically, and he, he just punches things really hard. You wouldn't think that he would just walk up here and just mop up Demeter real easy. But I don't know. He's, <laughs> he's just doing it. <laughs> he's just good. <laughs> Okay, if that was a crit, that would have been the end of, uh, end of the fight right there. So there you go. If that was if that was a crit, we would have ended the fight. That would have been over. Oh no, she has her guts technically, but you get what I'm saying. Kentucky Rider pretty much hard carrying the rest of the strike. No Scotties at all, by the way. I imagine this would be a bit easier if we actually had Scotty to you know give Kentucky buffs. A lot of these NPs would go from like, ooh, I really hope he kills right here to like, okay, watch him mop this up. Watch him clean up real quick. And then we have these two goofy goobers who could realistically just be anything. Let's get the attack buff. Just give him the cluster buff, I guess, man. Because you're... Well, she doesn't have defensive buffs, so never mind. Probably could have given that to Kets. Eh, doesn't matter. You know what, Mash? Do you want to do some damage? Can you give me 20k? Can you give me 20k, Mash? All right, I'm going to let her do it. I'm gonna let her do it. I believe in Mash, but I'm gonna back it up with Kentucky Rider in case she. <laughs> yeah, good shot. I knew she was gonna mess it up. Uh, yeah, I had to throw. Mm -hmm, gotta throw it. I had to put Kentucky right there. I'm not wasting an NP on 10k HP, dog. Easy clap, dude. And I would just coast through the rest of this. Kind of just coast through. Because now we'll get Kentucky Rider's NP back. We'll do like a solid 90, maybe 100k. Or never mind, she just doesn't attack us very much. Demeter, can you attack me, please? Like, I need you to, you know, kind of hit me at least once or twice so I can, 
you know, fire my NPs. Now she's just being difficult because she knows that we're about to mop her up real quick. We know she knows we're about to we're about to beat her up. She knows. She knows it's about to be over. She knows it's a wrap. Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fire crits. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ain't nobody care. Ain't nobody asked. Oh, my goodness. The Kentucky sweep. Why would I use the mash invincibility? I don't care if she's here or not. Mash is literally only here because she's zero cost. We didn't even have to bring her. Mash does nothing. Why do I care about the battery? Why do I care? It literally doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, bro. We're cooking. Okay, maybe we're not cooking. Maybe bro's cooking nothing. Okay, that was a little, that was, that was a little mean. That was a little uncalled for. That was not called for, bro. I was uncalled for, but you know what? People might say that Canis is the worst part of this fight, but Canis might come in and win us this fight real quick. <laughs> Psych. Unless we have no Kentucky cards. Okay, we do have Kentucky cards. Canis, get out of here. Look at this. Kentucky Rider just cooked up this entire fight. Bro, don't ever tell me that this fight is hard ever again. Bro, Kentucky is literally a guy that has two real skills. He has a quick buff. His NP just does damage and like nothing else. And then he has a battery. Bro got cooked by a year one servant. Demeter, you suck. You're terrible. Easy boss. I wasn't sweating for even a second. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, bro. That was, that, that was easy. That was easy money. That was a free ticket. That was essentially, I look at the Demeter fight. And I'm like, that's a free ticket. Now the Wodamine fight, it's not hard, but it is definitely annoying because it's a long and I'm not exactly looking forward to doing that one.